What's good, y'all? So I just saw something, man, I wanted to address. This dude posted a meme and it said, if we in a relationship and you mad, then you just want to stay mad because I ain't about to kiss your ass. Now, the problem isn't that one dude felt this way, but rather that tens of thousands of people was agreeing with him because the meme went viral. But for me, this shit don't make sense. Because my guess is if a girl is mad and she feels like what she feels is being ignored, so a better alternative to stay mad would be, hey, I'm listening, talk to me, let's work this out. And it don't matter who you are. If your boyfriend or your girlfriend is dealing with something, then you jump in and help them deal with it. That's not kissing ass, that's being an adult. Because for a second, let's just apply that logic to other areas. If you mad, stay mad. Like if you crying, stay crying. If you stressed, stay stressed. If you horny, stay horny. And I know a lot of you dudes ain't trying to hear that shit. Like imagine that. You get horny and she tell you to go suck your own dick. Or if you hungry, she tell you to cook your own food. You wouldn't just feel justified. You'd feel obligated to cheat. But when she's mad, a.k.a. so disturbed that it's time for you to put your pride aside and get to the bottom of it and you tell her she's on her own. That's not a relationship. That's an I hate you shit because that's what your actions say. But ain't it funny how, like, after the fact, when she finally walk away, that's when the dude got all this time to talk and he blowing up her phone and trying to read between the lines of every social media post to see how she feels? Nah, bro. That's when you can cuddle up with your pride and your ego since that was so much more important than understanding where she was coming from and what was on her mind. She gave you chances. You just thought it was cool to waste them. News break, Detroit, Michigan. I'm finally coming to you March 22nd. I'm going to do a live Q&A and give you all my story live and direct. Early bird tickets are available at the link in my caption. So the moral of the story is, I know you can't make your girl open up about what's on her mind, but what you can do is make yourself available to communicate with like the real man you claim to be. And if she's not ready to talk right that second, then you should still stay ready to listen for the moment she is, instead of listening to your pride and letting that be the reason that you lose her when it's all said and done.